Hello, How To Bob here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how I changed the battery in a 2009 Chevrolet Equinox 3.4 liter. Once we get the hood propped up, the battery is located on the right hand side, and it's underneath this module. You need to press down on the tab and slide the module back, and we'll set that out of the way. You can see the little tabs that it slides into. Set that out of the way. Then we need to remove the battery box. It lifts up from the back. There's a couple little tabs in the back that you may have to push down. This one came right off. These two front tabs hook right in the front. Then we're going to remove the bolt down at the bottom using a 13 millimeter socket and extension. And that's the block that holds the battery down. Once that's out, I can remove the terminals. And I found it easiest to use a 10 millimeter ratcheting wrench. Now I don't need to remove the nuts that hold the terminals in place. Just loosen them up a little bit, leave them on there, and then I can twist the terminals back and forth and they'll come off where I can set them off to the side. And then my battery should just pull straight up and out. I have my new battery, set it in. Slide it over to the side once I set it in. Then I can put my terminals on. And once I get my terminals on, I like to tap them down just a little bit to make sure that they're seated in place correctly. And I'll tighten the terminals back up using my 10 millimeter ratcheting wrench. Doesn't have to be real tight. Just want to make sure that it's snug down onto the terminals and that they do not rotate. At this point, you can put some dielectric grease or some kind of lithium grease over the terminals. Put my block back in place. If it doesn't fit, you want to slide the battery over to the driver's side of the car. Or as we're looking at it now, the right-hand side of the car. Then the block should fit in. And I'll use my 13 millimeter socket. Tighten that down. I'll put the two tabs underneath. The cover, slide the cover, get this lined up here, and then slide the cover down in the back and clip it into place. Then I can take my module and slide the little holes into the tabs, and then it'll click into place right here. And snap. And that's how you change the battery in a 2009 Chevrolet Equinox 3.4 liter. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon. I'm How To Bob. Thanks for watching.